Hey folks, Wayne Taylor, Honest Home Finder, out at Paddler's Cove with Dan Ryan Homes. Uh, there's another builder in here that I also like. You've seen a lot of videos if you check out any of my videos. Um, just out here today, uh, taking a look at some of their inventory so we can get some ideas of what their floor plans look like. Get a video walkthrough if that's your thing. Hopefully it is because that's what you're watching. Um, this is going to be a Cooper. It's a one and a half story, four bedroom, three bath, 2458. Now, I'm a realtor. I assist people in purchasing homes. I do like to do these videos just to give you a little idea of the builder, the floor plans, the neighborhood, things like that. Of course, you're going to have to read the description to get a little bit more on the builder. So this will be there, one and a half. Basically, call it a ranch if you don't want to have a whole lot going on upstairs. Secondary bedrooms first. They're decent. Have a good one, man. I like it too. Wash and dryer hookup. Huge open space. Now, you see all the caps. Put as much lighting in here as you want. Just waiting on somebody to do it for themselves instead of installing something that somebody doesn't like, which makes sense. Just makes it a little dark in here. This is a crazy design. Like I said, if you've seen my videos before, you, you know I love it when things are a little different. Not everybody goes for it and get that. Screened in porch. And again, folks, this is an inventory home. This doesn't come, they don't come with screened in porches. That's something you ask for. And, shocker, pay for. This feels bigger than the square footage. I'm digging it. It's just because it's big open space. Boom. It's the same thing. I go in a ton of ranch plans. I know this has the bedrooms upstairs. Bedroom upstairs. And a nice big uh, bonus room loft area, whatever you want to call it. And even down here is not bad because it's tough to do a lot of different things uh, with most of the dynamics on the main floor. For example, this is not the biggest master on the planet, but quite frankly, when people downsize, the homes like this are used to have most of the living space on the first floor. They know. They know. Yeah, I don't mind taking a picture of myself today. I'm wearing a decent shirt. Just don't have it tucked in, so don't judge me there. All right. This one has two linen style type closets in it. On top of the, uh, that's the second one. Just pointing at a closed door for you, can point that out. As well as the walk-in closet. I'm guessing they did that because the walk-in closet is not huge. Let's head upstairs real quick, folks. Okay, up we are. This is the bonus room I'm talking about. Nice big space. Any kind of entertaining that you like to do, you could put it here. You could put a bed in here. You're just not allowed to technically call it a bedroom. Quite frankly, I'm not sure why. Now this would be the specific bedroom. This has a door on it. Maybe that's the door. Anywho, folks, we're done with it. This is their one and a half story. Look at this area. Anyway, Wayne Taylor, Honest Home Finder. Uh, Dan Ryan Builders, Paddler's Cove. At the top of your screen, find out about the rebate. Huh? Add my incentives for the buyer to the builder's incentives for the buyer. They all have them. And uh, see what kind of uh, happiness you're going to put in your pocket. Thanks, guys.